Hi everyone, I'm Azim, and I wanted to share with you three things that you need to know about crypto custodians. Crypto custody has become one of the latest buzzword in the industry. With a growing interest of institutional investors for crypto, there is an increasing demand in the market for crypto custody. But what is crypto custody? How many crypto custodians are displaying serious solution in the market? Let's talk about it. Custody is a broad term that can be applied to a number of different solutions for digital asset storage. People have many choices when it comes to storing their crypto asset, and the connectivity of those solutions poses a unique concern for their customer. Solution ranges from self-custody options like a hardware or software wallet to third-party storage. Many of the solutions out there make use of hot storage, which is an environment connected to the internet, and cold storage, which is storing digital currencies away from an online connection. Some advocates believe that this could be one of the key factors needed to trigger an influx of new capital from institutional investors. There are around 80 crypto custodians today offering a wide range of solutions. Over the years, they have received 1.3 billion in investments. This figure has been growing with time. Some of the most famous ones are Bact, Fidelity, or Coinbase Custody, just to name a few. Other players also provide very innovative technologies, such as Fireblocks or Credo. You can find a list on our website, www.hedgecard.com. In a traditional fund management space, it is expected that funds use an independent third-party custodian. This is not as straightforward in the crypto space, given the realities of public and private keys. However, the crypto ecosystem has changed substantially, and there are now a large number of crypto custodians with increased security and competitive pricing. So it shouldn't be a surprise that while in 2018, just over half the funds used an independent custodian, there has been a significant increase since 2019. Over 80% of funds now use one or more independent custodian, either third party or exchange custodian. 